name's Anitha John. I'm an adult congenital heart disease attending at uh, DC Children's in Washington, DC. This is work that I did at the Mayo Clinic as a fellow looking at uh, coarctation repair in adults. This is primary surgical repair um, in adults over the age of 40. And our uh, intention was to take a look and see what the overall survival was and to see if we could identify any predictors of decreased survival in this population. And what we found was is that patients did uh, well in the immediate postoperative period. There was a low early mortality rate. Um, looking at overall survival, uh, patients who uh, had the surgery done had uh, about an 88% survival rate at 10 years, which is decreased from age and gender matched controls. Um, when we took a look at the actual ages, we found that patients who had their surgeries done over the age of 50 uh, had a much decreased survival at 10 years, especially when you compared them to age and gender matched controls. Um, patients who also had uh, more severe hypertension, uh, namely blood pressures greater than 160 over 90, um, had harder refractory blood pressures even after surgery. So I think it's important to uh, know from this data that patients who have coarctation of the aorta despite their age uh, still need to be corrected, and uh, correcting them will uh, improve their outcomes, overall outcomes, in terms of their blood pressures, in terms of the number of medications that they're on, and it's important certainly for knowledge for physicians and for patients.